the Environmental Economics MSc, you'll have an opportunity to study core areas of economic methods and theory, but you'll also be applying that to the areas of the environment. So you'll be studying natural resource economics, economics environmental policy, and how economists value environmental impact so that can be incorporated into decision making. You'll also have the opportunity to take options outside of economics, the environmental law, environment and development, and in terms of environmental impact assessment. So what that provides is a really sound basis in environmental economics, as well as the option to study some topics outside of environmental economics, but are related to the environment. It's an excellent research group. We're committed to the Environmental Economics MSc in terms of our teaching, and you'll be fully integrated into our group, which will allow you to experience environmental economics research in practice. I teach um, natural resource and economics, and it's a natural resource economics and environmental economics related course. And uh, for this course, uh, uh, I, what I want students to know that given one uh, natural resource and environmental related problem, how they can formally construct the prob problem given that you have a newspaper article or information about environmental problem and then formalize it, form it, uh, formally present the problem, solve it and get some intuitive explanation uh, how to get rid of the problem or policy recommendation. So that's the target, that's the objective of my course and I try them to learn this way. So. Uh, to deliver this, I, I follow this um, uh, inquiry-based learning technique in, in the classroom where in each, each and every lecture I give them exercise to solve. So in the exercise I, I, I provide, I state the real-world problem, environmental problem and natural resource problem. They read that, they try to formulate that, formally present that problem and solve it.